The animals that live in the pine forest environment. Animals living in the pine forest environment have adapted to the unique conditions these habitats provide. Pine forests are characterized by tall evergreen trees, dense underbrush, and often a thick layer of needles on the ground. These habitats provide a unique and diverse range of species adapted to living in these conditions. Layer of needles on the ground. These habitats provide a unique and diverse range of species adapted to living in these conditions. The most common animals found in pine forests are mammals, such as deer, squirrels, and bears. These animals are able to survive in this environment because of their ability to tolerate the cold temp. Richers and dense underbrush. Other animals found in pine forests include birds, reptiles, and certain fish species. Richers and dense underbrush. Other animals found in pine forests include birds, reptiles, and certain fish species. Birds are the most common animals found in pine forests, and are often found nesting in the trees and shrubs that make up these habitats. They feed on insects, which are abundant in these environments and use their keen eyesight to find their way around. Reptiles such as snakes and lizards are also found in pine forests, and are typically found near the water sources that are often found in these. And use their keen eyesight to find their way around. Reptiles such as snakes and lizards are also found in pine forests, and are typically found near the water sources that are often found in these. Habitats they feed on small invertebrates and are very sensitive to changes in their environment. Fish species such as the brook trout and the lake trout are also found in pine forests. These fish have adapted to living in cold, shallow waters and have developed specialized scales to protect them. From the cold. They feed on small insects and other aquatic life and rely on their keen sense of smell to find food and navigate their environment. From the cold. They feed on small insects and other aquatic life and rely on their keen sense of smell to find food and navigate their environment. Pine forests provide a unique and diverse range of species adapted to living in these conditions. These animals have adapted to the cold temperatures and dense underbrush and are able to survive in tea. Essay Habitats Mammals Birds, reptiles, and certain fish species are all adapted to living in pine forests and provide a unique and interesting insight into the diversity of species that can survive. Essay Habitats Mammals, birds, reptiles, and certain fish species are all adapted to living in pine forests and provide a unique and interesting insight into the diversity of species that can survive. And these habitats Pine forests are a unique and important ecosystem, characterized by their tall, straight trees and fragrant pine needles. These forests are home to a variety of plant and animal species that have ADA. Ted to living in this pine-dominated environment. Animals living in the pine forest environment include both herbivores and carnivores, ranging from small rodents and birds to larger mammals such as Ted to living in this pine-dominated environment. Animals living in the pine forest environment include both herbivores and carnivores, ranging from small rodents and birds to larger mammals such as Ears and deer One of the most common animals found in pine forests is the white-tailed deer, which feeds on a variety of vegetation found in the forest understory. These deer are important prey for predators such as wolves and cougars, which also inhabit the pine forest environment. Other herbivorous animals found in pine forests include hares, rabbits, and squirrels, which feed on pine cones and other vegetate. As wolves and cougars, which also inhabit the pine forest environment. Other herbivorous animals found in pine forests include hares, rabbits, and squirrels, which feed on pine cones and other vegetate. 
on found in the forest. Carnivorous animals found in pine forests include a variety of predators, ranging from small predators such as weasels and foxes to larger predators such as bears and lynx. These animals feed on a va. Idy of prey, including herbivores such as deer and smaller prey such as rodents and birds. Idy of prey, including herbivores such as deer and smaller prey such as rodents and birds. In addition to mammals, pine forests are also home to a variety of bird species, ranging from tiny songbirds to large raptors such as eagles and hawks. Many of these birds rely on the pine forest and Remain for food and shelter, building nests in the trees and feeding on insects and other small prey found in the forest. Remain for food and shelter, building nests in the trees and feeding on insects and other small prey found in the forest. Reptiles and amphibians are also found in pine forests, though they are less common than mammals and birds. Species such as the garter snake and the red-backed salamander are adapted to living in the Cool, damp environment of the forest floor, feeding on insects and other small prey. Cool, damp environment of the forest floor, feeding on insects and other small prey. Overall, animals living in the pine forest environment have adapted to the unique characteristics of this ecosystem, relying on the tall, straight trees and fragrant pine needles for food and shelter. As we continue to study and understand these important ecosystems, it is essential that we take action to protect and conserve them, ensuring that they continue to provide the many benefits that we. As we continue to study and understand these important ecosystems, it is essential that we take action to protect and conserve them, ensuring that they continue to provide the many benefits that we. Elion for our survival and well-being. Pine forests support an abundance of wildlife adapted to the unique conditions these ecosystems provide. Covering vast areas of the northern hemisphere, pine forests offer a mix of environmental nick. As within conifer canopies, understory layers, forest floors, and open treeless areas that specialist animals utilize. As within conifer canopies, understory layers, forest floors, and open treeless areas that specialist animals utilize. The closed canopy of pine forest trees provides habitat for arboreal animals. Birds like chickadees, nuthatches, and warblers forage on pine needles and cone seeds. They nest in the branches and buell. Their nests out of pine twigs. Red squirrels feed predominantly on pine cone seeds and build caching chambers within the large branches to store extra food. Flying squirrels glide between the canopy. Their nests out of pine twigs. Red squirrels feed predominantly on pine cone seeds and build caching chambers within the large branches to store extra food. Flying squirrels glide between the canopy. Trees at night. Red-backed voles nest in tree crevices and feed on bark, cambium tissue, and pine needles. Other animals like chipmunks, tree frogs, snakes, and beetle larvae also utilize the vertical. The shrubby understory of pine forests provides hiding places for various wildlife species. Small rodents like white-footed mice nest beneath ferns and moss growing between saplings. Lizards like fen. E-skinks bask on warm rocks and fallen logs amid the understory vegetation. A wide assortment of insects including grasshoppers, dragonflies, and moths utilize understory plants as food sources and oh. E-skinks bask on warm rocks and fallen logs amid the understory vegetation. A wide assortment of insects including grasshoppers, dragonflies, and moths utilize understory plants as food sources and oh. Eposition sites. Carnivorous species like chipmunks and shrews forage for food among the thickets of vegetation. Many bird species use the understory layer to nest, 
hide from predators, and stay shell. The forest floor underneath pine canopies hosts different animals specifically adapted to life among the pine needles, cones, and seed banks. Clethrionomies voles forage primarily on pine seeds that age. They fall into the ground from cones. Porcupines feed on twigs and bark scraped from downed trees and logs. Deer mice occupy loose piles of pine needles and fallen branches in search of invertebrates. They fall into the ground from cones. Porcupines feed on twigs and bark scraped from downed trees and logs. Deer mice occupy loose piles of pine needles and fallen branches in search of invertebrates. Insects like ants, beetle larvae, and millipedes decompose pine litter and release essential nutrients back into the ecosystem. Centipedes and ground beetles prey upon the smaller invertebrates within. Openings within pine forests provide important habitat for a number of wildlife species. Meadow voles inhabit grassy clearings where they feed on herbaceous vegetation. Upland sandpipers and several. Paro species nest in the grass forb clusters that grow in forest openings. White-tailed deer browse on new growth in forest clearings created by fallen trees or human disturbance. Woodpeckers and G. Paro species nest in the grass forb clusters that grow in forest openings. White-tailed deer browse on new growth in forest clearings created by fallen trees or human disturbance. Woodpeckers and G. Ooze feed on larvae infesting dead or dying trees within clearings. Many carnivorous mammals utilize forest openings to hunt for prey, including coyotes, foxes and fishers. Open areas within Pine 4 In summary, pine forests support a diverse array of wildlife species through the complex structural habitats they provide. Animals have adapted specialized behaviors and physical traits to effectival. Utilize the vertical strata, understory layer, forest floor and openings within pine ecosystems. However, threats to pine forests from fire suppression, logging, and disease are also impacting the pen. The animals that live in the desert environment Animals living in the desert environment have adapted to the unique conditions these habitats provide. Desert habitats are characterized by extreme temperatures, sparse vegetation, and often a lack of water. These habitats provide a unique and diverse range of species adapted to living in these conditions. Water these habitats provide a unique and diverse range of species adapted to living in these conditions. The most common animals found in desert habitats are reptiles, such as snakes and lizards. These animals are able to survive in this environment because of their ability to tolerate the extreme tempi. A tourist and lack of vegetation. Other animals found in desert habitats include birds, mammals, and certain fish species. A tourist and lack of vegetation. Other animals found in desert habitats include birds, mammals, and certain fish species. Birds are the most common animals found in desert habitats and are often found nesting in the trees and shrubs that make up these habitats. They feed on insects, which are abundant in these environments. T.S., and use their keen eyesight to find their way around. Mammals such as rabbits and foxes are also found in desert habitats and are typically found near the water sources that are often found in T.H. T.S., and use their keen eyesight to find their way around. Mammals such as rabbits and foxes are also found in desert habitats and are typically found near the water sources that are often found in T.H. Say habitats. They feed on small invertebrates and are very sensitive to changes in their environment. Fish species such as the desert pupfish and the desert goby are also found in desert habitats. 
These fish have adapted to living in the harsh desert environment and have developed specialized scales. Oh, protect them from the sun. They feed on small insects and other aquatic life and rely on their keen sense of smell to find food and navigate their environment. Oh, protect them from the sun. They feed on small insects and other aquatic life and rely on their keen sense of smell to find food and navigate their environment. Desert habitats provide a unique and diverse range of species adapted to living in these conditions. These animals have adapted to the extreme temperatures and lack of vegetation and are able to serve. They in these habitats. Reptiles, birds, mammals, and certain fish species are all adapted to living in desert habitats and provide a unique and interesting insight into the diversity of species that see. They in these habitats. Reptiles, birds, mammals, and certain fish species are all adapted to living in desert habitats and provide a unique and interesting insight into the diversity of species that see. And survive in these habitats. Deserts are one of the harshest environments on Earth, characterized by their extreme temperatures, sparse vegetation, and lack of water. Despite these challenging conditions, a wide variety of anima species have adapted to living in the desert environment. From small rodents and reptiles to large mammals and birds, animals living in the desert have developed unique adaptations that allow them to. Species have adapted to living in the desert environment. From small rodents and reptiles to large mammals and birds, Animals living in the desert have developed unique adaptations that allow them to survive in this challenging environment. One of the most iconic animals found in the desert environment is a camel. These animals are well adapted to life in the desert, with broad, padded feet that allow them to walk on sand without sink. Ing and the ability to store water in their bodies for long periods of time. Camels are important for transportation and commerce in desert regions, providing a means of carrying goods and people acro. Ing and the ability to store water in their bodies for long periods of time. Camels are important for transportation and commerce in desert regions, providing a means of carrying goods and people acro. As the harsh terrain. Other large mammals commonly found in desert environments include the jackrabbit, coyote, and gazelle. These animals have developed specialized adaptations that allow them to survive in the harsh con. Ishans of the desert. Jackrabbits have long, powerful legs that allow them to move quickly across the desert terrain while coyotes and gazelles have developed keen senses of smell and sight that all. Ishans of the Desert Jackrabbits have long, powerful legs that allow them to move quickly across the desert terrain, while coyotes and gazelles have developed keen senses of smell and sight that all. W them to detect prey and predators from great distances. Reptiles are also common in desert environments, with species such as the rattlesnake and the Gila monster well adapted to life in the arid conditions of the desert. These animals are able to survive. For long periods of time without water, relying on their ability to store moisture in their bodies and to regulate their body temperature in order to survive. For long periods of time without water, relying on their ability to store moisture in their bodies and to regulate their body temperature in order to survive. Birds are also important inhabitants of desert environments, with a wide variety of species relying on the desert environment for food and shelter. Raptors such as eagles and hawks are common in Deze. Tea environments, feeding on small rodents and other prey. Songbirds and other small bird species also rely on desert environments for nesting and feeding. 
T environments, feeding on small rodents and other prey. Songbirds and other small bird species also rely on desert environments for nesting and feeding. Insects and other small creatures are also important inhabitants of desert environments, with species such as the scorpion and the tarantula well adapted to life in the harsh conditions of the desert. These animals are able to survive in the desert by hiding in crevices and underground burrows during the hottest parts of the day, and by coming out at night to hunt for prey. These animals are able to survive in the desert by hiding in crevices and underground burrows during the hottest parts of the day, and by coming out at night to hunt for prey. Overall, animals living in the desert environment have adapted to the unique challenges and opportunities of this ecosystem in a variety of ways. From storing water in their bodies to developing speck. Allized adaptations for hunting and survival, these animals demonstrate the incredible adaptability and resilience of life on Earth. As scientists continue to study these fascinating creatures, we will. Allized adaptations for hunting and survival, these animals demonstrate the incredible adaptability and resilience of life on Earth. As scientists continue to study these fascinating creatures, we will. Undoubtedly learn even more about the unique challenges and opportunities of life in the desert environment. Deserts may seem barren and lifeless, yet a surprising variety of animals have adapted to thrive in these harsh environments. Deserts cover around one-third of the Earth's land surface and are caric. Arise by low and unpredictable rainfall, intense solar radiation, large daily temperature swings, and limited primary productivity. Animals inhabiting deserts have evolved specialized physical, beha. Arise by low and unpredictable rainfall, intense solar radiation, large daily temperature swings, and limited primary productivity. Animals inhabiting deserts have evolved specialized physical, beha. Ural and physiological adaptations that enable them to cope with the rigors of desert life. Reptiles dominate desert animal communities due to their low water requirements, ability to behaviorally thermoregulate, and production of tough-shelled eggs. Lizards and snakes bask on rocks and sand. To raise their body temperature before becoming active, compact bodies minimize surface area to reduce water loss. Nocturnal activity prevents dehydration and escape from predators is aided by Camus. To raise their body temperature before becoming active, compact bodies minimize surface area to reduce water loss. Nocturnal activity prevents dehydration and escape from predators is aided by Camus. Lodged coloration Horned lizards depend exclusively on harvester ants as a food source. Spadefoot toads burrow underground during dry periods and emerge only after rains. Small mammals inhabit deserts using strategies such as nocturnal activity, dormancy, and specialized kidneys to conserve water. Kangaroo rats search for seeds and plants at night and use their large Eat to kick sand over themselves as camouflage. Jerboas conserve water via specialized kidneys and spend most of their time above ground, relying on speed and leaping abilities to avoid predators. G. Eat to kick sand over themselves as camouflage. Jerboas conserve water via specialized kidneys and spend most of their time above ground, relying on speed and leaping abilities to avoid predators. G. Bills and jeards produce thick fur and dormancy to survive periods without accessible water. Desert woodrats construct pronounced nasal turbinates to recover water from exhaled air. Pronghorn antelope Birds utilize many physiological and behavioral adaptations to live in arid environments. Vultures obtain moisture from the fluids and tissues of carrion. Sand grouse transport water to their young in. 
Specialized chin glands. Nocturnal owls are active when temperatures are cooler and prey is most available. Diurnal species like larks have efficient kidneys allowing them to go without drinking weight. Specialized chin glands. Nocturnal owls are active when temperatures are cooler and prey is most available. Diurnal species like larks have efficient kidneys allowing them to go without drinking weight. For long periods, ground nesting birds like sandpipers and coursers rely on the thermal properties of sand to regulate egg temperatures. Many desert birds are migratory, only utilizing desert areas. Invertebrates survive in deserts by avoiding desiccation, producing drought resistant stages, and concentrating metabolic wastes. Acacia ants obtain water from the nectar and ants of the acacia tree. Features of the Geography of South America The geography of South America is characterized by a variety of features, from mountains and deserts to rivers and rainforests. South America is the fourth largest continent in the world and is home. Oh, a variety of landscapes and climates. Oh, a variety of landscapes and climates. One of the most prominent features of the geography of South America is the Andes mountain range. The Andes is the longest mountain range in the world and is home to a variety of species. It is also an important source of water for the people and animals living in the region, and it helps to regulate the water cycle. An important source of water for the people and animals living in the region, and it helps to regulate the water cycle. The Amazon rainforest is another important feature of the geography of South America. The Amazon is the largest rainforest in the world and is home to a variety of species. It is also an important so. Reserve of water for the people and animals living in the region, and it helps to regulate the water cycle. Reserve of water for the people and animals living in the region, and it helps to regulate the water cycle. The Atacama Desert is another important feature of the geography of South America. The Atacama is the driest desert in the world and is home to a variety of species. It is also an important source of water for the people and animals living in the region, and it helps to regulate the water cycle. Water for the people and animals living in the region, and it helps to regulate the water cycle. The geography of South America is characterized by a variety of features, from mountains and deserts to rivers and rainforests. From the Andes to the Amazon to the Atacama, these features are Asante. L for the health of the planet and its inhabitants. It is essential that we protect and conserve these habitats in order to ensure their continued existence. L for the health of the planet and its inhabitants. It is essential that we protect and conserve these habitats in order to ensure their continued existence. South America is a continent with a diverse range of geography, characterized by its towering mountains, expansive rainforests, and winding river systems. The continent is home to a wide variety of p. Ant and animal species, many of which are found nowhere else on Earth. Some of the most notable features of the geography of South America include the Andes Mountains, the Amazon Rainforest, and the Ant and animal species, many of which are found nowhere else on Earth. Some of the most notable features of the geography of South America include the Andes Mountains, the Amazon Rainforest, and the Takama Desert. The Andes Mountains are one of the most prominent features of South America, stretching over 7,000 kilometers from north to south. These towering peaks are home to a wide variety of plant and animal. 
Pishis, ranging from high-altitude grasses and shrubs to large mammals such as llamas and bakunas. The Andes are also important for their role in regulating the Earth's climate, with their high oliva. Pishis, ranging from high-altitude grasses and shrubs to large mammals such as llamas and bakunas. The Andes are also important for their role in regulating the Earth's climate, with their high oliva. Ion and rugged terrain helping to absorb carbon dioxide from the atmosphere and release oxygen through photosynthesis. The Amazon rainforest is another important feature of the geography of South America, covering over 6 million square kilometers and containing the largest river system in the world. This rainforest I Home to a dizzying array of plant and animal species, including jaguars, monkeys and a variety of bird species. The Amazon is also important for its role in regulating the Earth's climate, absorbin. Home to a dizzying array of plant and animal species, including jaguars, monkeys and a variety of bird species. The Amazon is also important for its role in regulating the Earth's climate, absorbin. Large amounts of carbon dioxide from the atmosphere and releasing oxygen through photosynthesis. The Atacama Desert is one of the driest places on Earth, covering a large portion of the western coast of South America. This desert is characterized by its arid climate and sparse vegetation, with p. Ant and animal species adapted to living in the harsh conditions of this environment. Despite its challenging conditions, the Atacama Desert is home to a variety of plant and animal species, including Ant and animal species adapted to living in the harsh conditions of this environment. Despite its challenging conditions, the Atacama Desert is home to a variety of plant and animal species, including Cacti, lizards, and other reptiles Other notable features of the geography of South America include the Orinoco and Rio de la Plata river systems, which provide important habitat for a variety of plant and animal species. The Guiana H. Glens and the Brazilian highlands are also important mountain ranges, home to a range of plant and animal species. Glens and the Brazilian highlands are also important mountain ranges, home to a range of plant and animal species. Overall, the geography of South America is characterized by its diversity and complexity, with a range of ecosystems and habitats that support a wide variety of plant and animal species. As we content, E to study and understand these important ecosystems, it is essential that we take action to protect and conserve them, ensuring that they continue to provide the many benefits that we rely on for U. E to study and understand these important ecosystems, it is essential that we take action to protect and conserve them, ensuring that they continue to provide the many benefits that we rely on for U. Survival and well-being South America is known for its striking geographic features that shape its ecology, culture and economy. The continent spans from the Caribbean coast to Tierra del Fuego and includes diverse biomes f. On the Amazon rainforest to the Atacama Desert. Some key geographic features that characterize South America include the Andes Mountains, the Amazon River Basin, vast coastal plains and diverse ecosy. Own the Amazon rainforest to the Atacama Desert. Some key geographic features that characterize South America include the Andes Mountains, the Amazon River Basin, vast coastal plains, and diverse ecosy. Tens The Andes Mountains form the longest continuous mountain range in the world, running the entire western side of South America from Venezuela to Tierra del Fuego. The Andes are a product of tectonic A. 
activity along the boundary of the Nazca and South American plates. Peaks in the Andes exceed 6,000 meters in elevation with Aconcagua at 6,961 meters the highest point in South America. The Andes DV Activity along the boundary of the Nazca and South American plates Peaks in the Andes exceed 6,000 meters in elevation with Aconcagua at 6,961 meters the highest point in South America. The Andes DV E South America into distinct eastern and western regions with profound consequences for climate, biodiversity and human settlement. The Andes prevent humid winds from reaching the western side of Th. The Amazon River Basin covers 40% of South America and contains the largest rainforest and most biodiverse ecosystem on Earth. The Amazon River originates in the Andes and flows eastward across the A. Amazon Basin to the Atlantic Ocean. More than 1,100 tributaries feed into the Amazon system, which discharges approximately one-fifth of the world's running freshwater. The Amazon forest hosts about 10. Amazon Basin to the Atlantic Ocean. More than 1,100 tributaries feed into the Amazon system, which discharges approximately one-fifth of the world's running freshwater. The Amazon forest hosts about 10. Of the world's known plant and animal species including thousands of higher plants, hundreds of mammals and over 1,500 bird species. Indigenous peoples have inhabited the Amazon basin for at least one. Vast coastal plains characterize eastern South America from the Amazon river mouth to the La Plata estuary. The Pampas grasslands of Argentina cover over 750,000 square kilometers and supported the sea. Toll drives that fueled gaucho culture. The agricultural potential of the fertile coastal plains has also enabled agricultural expansion and urban sprawl, particularly along the eastern coast of Braz. Toll drives that fueled gaucho culture. The agricultural potential of the fertile coastal plains has also enabled agricultural expansion and urban sprawl, particularly along the eastern coast of Braz. L. The Atlantic forest that once covered large parts of the coastal plains contained an amazing array of biodiversity but is now highly fragmented due to human disturbance. The coastal zones are also The diverse ecosystems of South America including the Amazon rainforest, Andean Paramo, Mediterranean scrublands and Patagonian steppes support high levels of endemism with many species found nowhere. Else, South America contains some of the world's most biodiverse habitats including the Amazon, Cerrado Savanna, Atlantic Forest and Chilean Temperate Rainforest slash Valdivian Temperate Rainforest. However, South America contains some of the world's most biodiverse habitats including the Amazon, Cerrado Savanna, Atlantic Forest and Chilean Temperate Rainforest slash Valdivian Temperate Rainforest. However, threats ranging from habitat destruction and encroachment to overhunting and climate change now endanger many South American ecosystems and species. Sustainable Management Strategies and Ecoregiona In summary, South America's striking geographic features have shaped its ecology, people and development in profound ways. The Andes Mountains, Amazon River Basin, vast coastal plains and diversity O. Overview of the country's geography Mozambique Mozambique is a country located in southeastern Africa, bordered by Tanzania to the north, Malawi and Zambia to the northwest, Zimbabwe to the west, South Africa and Eswatini to the southwest, and th. Indian Ocean to the east. With a total area of approximately 801,590 square kilometers, it is the 35th largest country in the world. Indian Ocean to the east. 
with a total area of approximately 801,590 square kilometers, it is the 35th largest country in the world. Mozambique's geography is diverse, with a mix of highlands, plateaus, and coastal plains. The country is dominated by the Zambezi River, which runs through the central and northern parts of the count. Y, and the Limpopo River, which forms part of the border with South Africa. The highest peak in Mozambique is Monte Binga, which stands at 2,436 meters. The country's coastline is approximately 2,470. Y, and the Limpopo River, which forms part of the border with South Africa. The highest peak in Mozambique is Monte Binga, which stands at 2,436 meters. The country's coastline is approximately 2,470. Kilometers long, with beautiful beaches and coral reefs that are home to a wide range of marine life. Mozambique has a tropical climate, with a wet season that runs from November to March and a dry season that runs from April to October. Temperatures are generally high throughout the year, with the sea. Also areas experiencing average temperatures of around 27 degrees Celsius, while the inland areas are slightly cooler. Mozambique is also prone to natural disasters such as cyclones, floods, and droughts, which see. Also areas experiencing average temperatures of around 27 degrees Celsius, while the inland areas are slightly cooler. Mozambique is also prone to natural disasters such as cyclones, floods, and droughts, which see and have a significant impact on the country's economy and infrastructure. Mozambique is a country rich in natural resources, including coal, natural gas, titanium, and precious stones. The country is also home to a wide range of plant and animal species, with over 5,500 sp. Seas of plants and 740 species of birds. The Zambezi River is home to a number of important fish species, including the tigerfish and the bream. Mozambique is also home to a number of important wildlife. Seas of plants and 740 species of birds. The Zambezi River is home to a number of important fish species, including the tigerfish and the bream. Mozambique is also home to a number of important wildlife. Fay Reserves including the Gorongosa National Park, which is home to a wide range of animals such as lions, elephants, and buffalo. The vegetation in Mozambique is diverse, with a mix of savanna, woodland, and forest. The country is home to a number of important plant species, including the baobab tree, which is revered for its M. Dicinal properties, and the cashew tree, which is an important cash crop for the country. Mozambique's forests are also home to a number of important timber species, including the African teak and th. Dicinal properties, and the cashew tree, which is an important cash crop for the country. Mozambique's forests are also home to a number of important timber species, including the African teak and th. African mahogany In terms of agriculture, Mozambique is a country that is rich in potential, with fertile land and a long growing season. The country's main agricultural products include cashew nuts, cotton, sugar, A. D. Tobacco. Mozambique is also a major producer of coconuts, with over 60,000 hectares of coconut plantations. D. Tobacco. Mozambique is also a major producer of coconuts, with over 60,000 hectares of coconut plantations. Mozambique is a country with a population of approximately 31 million people, with a majority of the population living in rural areas. The official language is Portuguese, although many Mozambicans also speak indigenous languages such as Makua and Sina. Islam is the dominant religion, with approximately 18% of the population being Muslim, while Christianity is practiced by around 28% of the p. Also speak indigenous languages such as Makua and Sina. Islam is the dominant religion, with approximately 18% of the population being Muslim, while Christianity is practiced by around 28% of the p. Population 
Mozambique has a rich cultural heritage, with a blend of African, Arab, and Portuguese influences. Traditional music and dance are an important part of Mozambican culture, with a wide range of styles and instruments, including the marimba, the timbila, and the muvira. Mozambique is also known for its vibrant arts and crafts scene, with artisans producing a wide range of handmade goods such as text and instruments, including the marimba, the timbila, and the muvira. Mozambique is also known for its vibrant arts and crafts scene, with artisans producing a wide range of handmade goods such as text, lay, pottery, and wood carvings. Mozambique has a mixed economy, with agriculture, industry, and services all contributing to the country's GDP. The country's main exports include coal, natural gas, and cashew nuts. Mozambique is al. O home to a number of important industries, including fishing, forestry, and tourism. The country's beautiful beaches and coral reefs, as well as its national parks and wildlife reserves, make it a p. O home to a number of important industries, including fishing, forestry, and tourism. The country's beautiful beaches and coral reefs, as well as its national parks and wildlife reserves, make it a p. Pillar destination for tourists from around the world. Mozambique is a country that has faced a number of challenges in recent years, including political instability, poverty, and natural disasters. The country was devastated by a civil war that lasted f. Om 1977 to 1992, and has also been hit hard by natural disasters such as cyclones and floods. Despite these challenges, Mozambique has made significant progress in recent years, with a growing economy. Om 1977 to 1992, and has also been hit hard by natural disasters such as cyclones and floods. Despite these challenges, Mozambique has made significant progress in recent years, with a growing economy. And improvements in infrastructure and social services. In terms of education, Mozambique has made significant progress in recent years, with an increasing number of children attending school. However, the country still faces challenges in terms of access to education, particularly in rural areas. Mozambique also has a high rate of HIV AIDS, with approximately 13% of the adult population living with the disease. To education, particularly in rural areas. Mozambique also has a high rate of HIV AIDS, with approximately 13% of the adult population living with the disease. Mozambique is also a country that is committed to protecting its environment and natural resources. The government has implemented a number of initiatives aimed at promoting sustainable development a. d. Protecting the country's fragile ecosystems. Mozambique is home to a number of important conservation areas, including the Quirumbas National Park and the Bizarrudo Archipelago National Park, which d. Protecting the country's fragile ecosystems. Mozambique is home to a number of important conservation areas, including the Quirumbas National Park and the Bizarrudo Archipelago National Park, which re known for their rich biodiversity and stunning natural beauty. Mozambique is also a country that is rich in history, with a number of important historical sites and landmarks. The Ilha de Mozambique, a small island off the coast of the mainland, was once the cap. Tal of Portuguese East Africa and is now a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The island is home to a number of important historical buildings, including the Fort of São Sebastião and the Chapel of Nossa Sé. Tal of Portuguese East Africa and is now a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The island is home to a number of important historical buildings, including the Fort of São Sebastião and the Chapel of Nossa Sé. Ora de Baluert, which was built in 1522 and is the oldest surviving European building in the Southern Hemisphere. Mozambique is a country that is also known for its vibrant and colorful markets, which are a hub of activity and a great place to experience the local culture. The markets offer a wide range of goods, 
including fresh produce, handmade crafts, and traditional textiles. Some of the most famous markets in Mozambique include the Fera Popular in Maputo, the Central Market in Bera, and the Market Inn. Including fresh produce, handmade crafts, and traditional textiles. Some of the most famous markets in Mozambique include the Fera Popular in Maputo, the Central Market in Bera, and the Market Inn. He Town of Mashishi Mozambique is also a country that is home to a number of important festivals and celebrations throughout the year. One of the most famous is the Festival of the Dao Countries, which takes place Anu. Lily in the city of Zanzibar and features performances by musicians and artists from around the world. Other notable festivals in Mozambique include the Mapiko Festival, which celebrates traditional M. Lily in the city of Zanzibar and features performances by musicians and artists from around the world. Other notable festivals in Mozambique include the Mapiko Festival, which celebrates traditional M. Khan Culture and the Marabenta Festival which celebrates Mozambique's unique music style. Finally, it's worth noting that Mozambique is a country that is deeply committed to promoting gender equality and empowering women. The government has implemented a number of initiatives aimed at imp. Oving women's access to education, health care, and economic opportunities, and there are a number of active women's rights organizations in the country. Despite facing challenges such as domestic VO, An overview of the country's geography in Nicaragua. Nicaragua is a country located in Central America, with a diverse landscape that includes beaches, mountains, rainforests, and lakes. The country covers a total area of approximately 130,000 square k. Lamaders, making it slightly smaller than the state of New York. Lamaders, making it slightly smaller than the state of New York. Nicaragua has a tropical climate, with two distinct seasons, the dry season from December to May, and the rainy season from June to November. The country's weather is influenced by trade winds from T. E. Caribbean Sea and Pacific Ocean, as well as its proximity to the equator. E. Caribbean Sea and Pacific Ocean, as well as its proximity to the equator. Nicaragua is known for its abundant natural resources, including fertile farmland, mineral deposits, and renewable energy sources. The country is a major exporter of agricultural products, including Afi, bananas, and beef. It also has a growing tourism industry with visitors drawn to its natural beauty and cultural heritage. The country is also investing in renewable energy sources, including Afi, bananas, and beef. It also has a growing tourism industry, with visitors drawn to its natural beauty and cultural heritage. The country is also investing in renewable energy sources, including Hydropower, geothermal power, and wind power. Nicaragua's flora and fauna are diverse, with many unique and endangered species found in the country. The country's rainforests are home to a variety of tree species, including the mahogany tree. Me. Aragua's marine life is also diverse, with several species of sharks, whales, and sea turtles found in the surrounding waters. Aragua's marine life is also diverse, with several species of sharks, whales, and sea turtles found in the surrounding waters. Nicaragua has a rich cultural heritage, with a mix of indigenous, European, and African influences. The country's indigenous population includes several groups, such as the Mosquito and the Rama, who have their own languages and traditions. Nicaragua's colonial history is reflected in its architecture, with several historic buildings and churches found throughout the country. The country is also K. Have their own languages and traditions. Nicaragua's colonial history is reflected in its architecture, 
with several historic buildings and churches found throughout the country. The country is also K. Owned for its vibrant music and dance traditions, including the marimba and salsa. Nicaragua is a Central American country located between Honduras to the north and Costa Rica to the south. The country has a total area of 130,373 square kilometers, making it the largest country in Central America. Nicaragua can be divided into three main geographic regions, the Pacific Lowlands, the Central Highlands, and the Caribbean Lowlands. Central America. Nicaragua can be divided into three main geographic regions, the Pacific Lowlands, the Central Highlands, and the Caribbean Lowlands. The Pacific Lowlands are characterized by flat plains that stretch along the Pacific coast. This region is home to most of the population and is the country's economic center. The Central Highlands A. E. A mountainous region with a range of volcanoes, including the country's highest point, the San Cristobal Volcano, which stands at 1,745 meters. The Caribbean lowlands are a region of dense jungle. E. A mountainous region with a range of volcanoes, including the country's highest point, the San Cristobal Volcano, which stands at 1,745 meters. The Caribbean lowlands are a region of dense jungle. Ivers, and lagoons that is home to several indigenous communities. Nicaragua has a tropical climate with two distinct seasons, a rainy season from May to November and a dry season from December to April. Temperatures remain relatively constant throughout the year, W. TH average temperatures ranging from 25 to 30 degrees Celsius. TH average temperatures ranging from 25 to 30 degrees Celsius. The country is rich in natural resources, including gold, silver, copper, and timber. Agriculture is also a significant part of the economy, with coffee, bananas, sugarcane, and tobacco being the Mai. Crops. The country is also home to a diverse range of wildlife, including jaguars, ocelots, Howler monkeys and sloths. Crops. The country is also home to a diverse range of wildlife, including jaguars, ocelots, howler monkeys, and sloths. Nicaragua's vegetation is diverse and includes tropical rainforest, deciduous forest, and pine forest. The country's rainforest is home to a wide range of plant species, including orchids, bromeliads and ferns and ferns Nicaragua's wildlife is just as diverse as its vegetation the country is home to numerous species of reptiles including crocodiles iguanas and turtles the country's bird life is particularly rich with over 700 species of birds including toucans parrots and hummingbirds with over 700 species of birds, including toucans, parrots, and hummingbirds. Nicaragua is a fascinating country with a rich history and culture. The country has a population of over 6 million people, with a majority living in urban areas. Spanish is the official language, a. d. The country's culture is a blend of indigenous and Spanish influences. D. The country's culture is a blend of indigenous and Spanish influences. Nicaragua has a turbulent history, marked by political instability and conflict. The country experienced a revolution in the 1970s and 1980s, which led to the overthrow of the Somoza dictatorship and the establishment of a socialist government. The country has since transitioned to a democratic system of government, but political tensions and social unrest continue to be a challenge. The establishment of a socialist government. The country has since transitioned to a democratic system of government, but political tensions and social unrest continue to be a challenge. 
Despite its challenges, Nicaragua is a country with a vibrant culture and a rich artistic heritage. The country is home to numerous museums, galleries, and cultural institutions, including the nation. El Museum of Nicaragua and the Ruben Darío National Theater El Museum of Nicaragua and the Ruben Darío National Theater The country's cuisine is a reflection of its diverse cultural influences, with Spanish, indigenous, and African influences. The national dish is gallo pinto, a dish made with rice and beans, and is o. Oh. 10 served for breakfast other popular dishes include nicatamales, a type of tamale made with pork, rice, and vegetables, and vigoron, a dish made with yucca, pork rinds, and cabbage. 10 served for breakfast. Other popular dishes include nicatamales, a type of tamale made with pork, rice, and vegetables, and vigoron, a dish made with yucca, pork rinds, and cabbage. Nicaragua is also known for its coffee, which is considered among the best in the world. The country's coffee industry dates back to the 19th century, and coffee remains a significant part of the coup. Tri's Economy Tri's Economy In terms of tourism, Nicaragua has much to offer. The country is home to numerous natural attractions, including volcanoes, beaches, and rainforests. Popular tourist destinations include the Colonial. City of Granada, the beach town of San Juan del Sur, and the island of Omidip, which sits in the middle of Lake Nicaragua. City of Granada, the beach town of San Juan del Sur, and the island of Omidip, which sits in the middle of Lake Nicaragua. One aspect of Nicaragua that is worth exploring is its music and dance traditions. Nicaragua has a rich musical heritage that includes traditional folk music as well as more modern genres like salsa. ND Reggaeton The marimba, a type of percussion instrument that is similar to a xylophone, is a key instrument in traditional Nicaraguan music and is often played at festivals and celebrations. ND Reggaeton. The marimba, a type of percussion instrument that is similar to a xylophone, is a key instrument in traditional Nicaraguan music and is often played at festivals and celebrations. Nicaragua also has a vibrant dance scene, with traditional dances like the Palo de Mayo and the Sun Nica. The Palo de Mayo is a dance that is often performed during the month of May and involves dance. R.S. moving around a maypole while playing drums and other percussion instruments. The Sun Nika is a traditional dance that is often accompanied by live music and involves couples moving in synchronicity.